Welcome to Star Citizen. So the sprint report was last Thursday and they reminded us of quite a few things they've been working on. Starting with the ship trespass system, which started out as an idea and a good one of how other players can illegally be in your ship and you have a right to dispose of them so that you wouldn't be hit by a crime stat in this game. If he is trespassing, you have all the right to get rid of him and to follow him even to his ship without you getting a crime stat. And the intruder of course getting an instant crime stat when the hostilities break out. But it's not all good for the well ship owner itself, it's also good for the intruder, as he will no longer instantly join the comms channel, which could alert the ship owner of someone else being on the ship. This doesn't just apply for the first person, but also to the ships, if you're taking your own little ship into a, let's say, Hercules C2. You park it inside, you're not the owner, well, you do get a warning that you're trespassing. This being the biggest topic of the sprint. Now there's also some minor things like New Babbage getting more signs and the store and so on. Also on the ships like Vulture where you had two beams you can control like say salvage and you can control the tractor beam with the other so you can manage at the same time, you can use joysticks. Just an overall improvement to the Vulture and its beams. Also revisiting the Hawk and uh, remanaging or remaking the prison or wanted person storage of the Hawk. It has a special compartment for that. A small upgrade for the Freelancer, so we can fit all of its modules or its components inside of it. So there's a little nice look at that. A little beautiful look at Origin X1, which is the little hover bike. Also a little look at the white box phase of RSI Apollo Medivac, which I think can be a fun addition. And a little unofficial poke, which uh, isn't a hint for perhaps other variants of the ship. And before we get to the last thing, a little look at the Chantoquier. I believe that's what it's called, I hope because I can never pronounce it right. It's an alien medium fighter that is supposed to be very maneuverable. And for last, cargo system improvements, where let's say placing a cargo with these uneven boxes can be a bit unpleasant. It will try to find a better spot for it when you're using your tractor beam, which is a very good addition. This is a little summary which was discussed in the sprint report. I will leave a link down below if you're interested. And interestingly, there's still a lot of information coming and going, seeing as the CitizenCon is not that far away. Anyway, don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching.